10 sleeping animals who are definitely not part 1. Number 1. Squirrel monkeys are small, short haired and use their tail for balance, while they climb trees just like squirrels in some Germanic languages. They are actually referred to as a skull monkey due to the shape of their face or maybe because they look like they're dead asleep. Number 2. Do you ever get neck pain from standing around with no head support? Imagine if your neck was 10 times as long. Giraffes actually have high blood pressure and their heart is a long way from their head. So if they lower their head for too long, they get dizzy and can't stand up. Luckily, they found an adorable solution. Number 3. This doesn't look comfortable at all. But who are we to judge? Cats are practically liquid and can adjust to any shapes around them. When this Garfield is done sleeping, he'll probably look like the Michelin cat. Number 4. The warmth of the sun, the calming sound of the ocean, the soft feeling of sand underneath your feet. It's all very soothing. But to fall asleep face planting by the shoreline seems a bit much. Or maybe this elephant had few too many last night and got a bit drunk. Number 5. The way otters sleep is actually adorable in more ways than one. Of course, these little swimmers look cute with their eyes closed, but they also hold hands while they nap in order not to drift away from each other. What can we say? They really love their significant otter. Number 6. Who needs a baby carrier when your little one can just hold you by your hair? It doesn't sound too pleasant for mom, but Gorilla GR looks out like a light. It's all heartwarming and cute until they reach the Empire State Building. Number 7. Move over hippies. There's a new treat hugger in town. This adorable, big-eared little guy is called a Tarzer. It may look like a bat, but it's actually a primate. They are nocturnal, which means you can find them snoozing in the daytime. Number 8. There are a couple animals who sort of sleep upside down, but bats are the only one who can do it vertically. Turning their wings into snuggies, they hang outside side by side throughout the day. Don't worry, they won't even bat an eye. Number 9. This bear must have a good long day of chasing Goldilocks out of his house, eating honey with a piglet, protecting the forest and taking the train in London. We don't blame him. We don't blame him passing out on the nearest tree. Some days are just unbearable. Number 10 and last of all, despite the possible crumbs or stains, many of us like to eat in bed. But imagine if you could eat your bed. We can't comprehend how this bunny never gobbled up his sleeping quarters, but we have the greatest respect for his restraint.